So now let us uh, add the content in our spec definition file. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to start with uh, given and uh, okay, should be given. And uh, what I need to write over here is from my feature file. Uh, that is this given I navigate to the website. And then we need to add the arrow function. And then we have, after given, we have when and and. So same thing, I'm gonna just copy this structure and paste and say when and say and. And from this feature, Copy this, paste it here, copy this, and paste it here, right? So this should be as simple. And now, what we need to do, I navigate to the website. So I'm going to say C dot uh, visit, and we'll be navigating to the website that is this right and then uh, in this we need to click on bank manager login so first I am not using page objects right now I am actually uh, going to write uh, simple navigation steps so I'm gonna say cy dot get and in this I'm gonna get the element and we're gonna perform click on it so the element uh, css i'm gonna get it from here uh, inspect the element copy selector and paste it here and then uh, after we click on it we need to uh, validate uh, the page title so page title, I can do it like cy.title, title, and uh, I can say dot should equals the expected title. So if I click on this and get the title, so title, we're going to get it, title, so there's the title. So I did this, copy and paste it here, right? So let's try uh, running this much for the timing. I'll say npx cypress open. Okay, so I just updated to the latest version of uh, Cypress. So it is actually uh, saying you are running it for the first time. So prior was a 5.1 version, then I now recently updated to 5.3. And uh, when you open this, see, you are not able to uh, see whatever that we have in the test cases folder, right? You only see this feature file. This is because uh, what we have added in our uh, uh, support, that is uh, cypress.json file, so if we don't include this stuff, if I don't add this, then if you look over here, you're gonna see everything, right? But if I include this test file to feature, then you're gonna see only the feature file. And now when you click on this, it should actually gonna execute your feature. So let's see. So since I never given, I would never get to the website. And then I click on bank manager login button and then validate the title. So see, this is how it was very simple to integrate Cucumber with Cypress. So in the next module, we're gonna see how we can integrate the page objects that we have created how we can use them uh, with our Cucumber test as well. 
right? So that's all in this lecture. Thank you.